Hello, welcome to this tutorial on Wizard Pro, a software for undertaking multivariate analysis. The software is excellent, it's beautifully created. However, you have to be aware that multivariate analysis is a complex and an extensive subject in statistics. What Wizard Pro allows is the basics of multivariate analysis. So while it allows you to do multivariate analysis, I don't think it will ever replace a professional statistician who can give you advice on the nuances of multivariate analysis. So let's start. So what is Wizard Pro? It's a software for undertaking multivariate analysis only. What it doesn't do is it doesn't do general statistics for you. So it doesn't replace your SPSS, your GraphPad, Starta or SAP. You can't do survival analysis. Um, so you have to understand that. It only works on Mac. So while many physicians do have Macs, um, the fact that it doesn't have a Windows version is unfortunate. There are two versions. One is called the Wizard Statistical Analyzer. This is the basic form. And the second version is called Wizard Pro. The difference between those two is that um, the Wizard Pro allows you to import data from big statistical software like SAP, Starter, SPSS. Whereas the Wizard Statistical Analyzer lets you import data from Excel. So in practical terms, I think for most physicians, Wizard Statistical Analyzer is adequate. There's a considerable difference in the price between uh, these two versions. The software are only available through the iTunes store of the Apple company. The workflow of Wizard Pro can be div divided into a few sections. The import data, the raw data window where you can see the data, it's like an Excel window, function to filter data, function to analyze data using pivot table, uh, summarize data, this is where much of the st statistics regarding association is done. Then the next um, um, step in the workflow is creating the model. This is where the regression is done and then using the regression then you can do prediction. In this tutorial I am uh, just going to show an example. So I am not going to show you how to filter data and how to use pivot table um, to just keep things simple and straightforward. When you open Wizard Pro, there's option to view the in inbuilt tutorial. It's a beautifully created tutorial and I will definitely recommend that you go through that tutorial. However, in this uh, tutorial, I'm going to use a neurosurgical example. I've created a dummy file of uh, patients with chronic subdural hematoma admitted in a fictitious ward. The data that in this table are completely fictitious and so any results from the analysis is meaningless. The whole purpose of this um, dummy data set is to just to illustrate how the Wizard Pro works.